I hope you guys are having a wonderful holiday season. Uh, Christmas is over. I think today is the last day of Hanukkah. And I believe starting tomorrow, starting, uh, correct me if I'm wrong, guys. I think it's starting Kwanzaa starting tomorrow. So, yeah, let me know if uh, I was wrong about that. So, uh, I just finished installing Option O Meisenberg. Okay, so before I had SSP, the high uniformity birds. Now I have the Meisen. By the way, I know a lot of you, uh, if you guys purchased a P64 last year or so, kind of like me, okay? I, I went with a uh, high uniformity, the HU, the a, uh, SSP high uniformity birds, because at the time, you only have a couple of options, uh, stock birds and the H, uh, SSP HU. In the last year or so, Guess what, guys? There's a lot of birds coming out. Uh, SSP coming out with the Caspers. And we got the uh, uh, low uh, MP birds, okay? Now, the Meisen birds. So let me know in the comment section. Love to hear which birds you have on your P64. So, I just installed it. And uh, I'm gonna be posting the video, uh, maybe like tonight, uh, how to change birds on your P64. Uh, it's simple, but it's not simple, okay, because, you know, let me show you guys. All right. I think the seeing is a lot better here. Hold on, check it out. Okay. Give you guys an even closer view. Once you're going into the bottom birds, that space so tight, okay? Space is so tight, and it's hard to get your finger around it. And personally, I like to use chopstick. Okay. I know if for some of you chopstick at home, use that. I like to just work under each corners, this corner right there. Just work it out, just work it. Take your time, work it, and each corners. And then you can uh, safely uh, remove from the bottom boards there. I know some of you use the screw drive, but I prefer to use the wooden stick. So you do not want to scratch, okay? You do not want to damage the birds. So I, I prefer using chopstick is my choice, but you know what, that's your grinder. Do whatever you want with, with it. And after that, I'm gonna put the plug in power. And then everything works. Yeah, I mean, look, works pretty good, I have to say. Yeah, it works really nice. Do not put your finger in there, by the way. Let's give a close look on Meisen birds. So this is a Meisen. Seems more like a similar design to cast, if you ask me. Let's take a look here, close look. Uh, looking at the breaker. Okay. Very aggressive breaker. And the side views is pretty flat as well. Kind of like flat like MP. Very, yeah, flat like MP, but breakers there. Let's compare that to HU, high uniformity. Okay. It's flat, but watch this. You see the, the length? how much flat spa space you have compared to HU. Not as much, not as much. And also, look at the breakers there. They're extremely aggressive. I don't know how they come up with the HU, high uniformity. This is, this is nothing high uniform about it. Very aggressive. So this is really, if you're into espresso, HU is fantastic, okay, fantastic. But if you are a person like me, if you like both, HU, uh, like filter coffee as well. I mean, Meisen might be, I don't know, it might be the one, okay? So let's find out. So I already marked it, so that, that's my top position. So let's put everything back together, again. 
Man, I have to say, everything is so tight. Ring goes right inside. All right, and then we are going to put everything back in here. It took me about, <coughs> let's see here. I did take my time, so like 15 minutes or so. The hard part was to get the bottom birds out. Okay. All right, so we're going to center. So we know that's our zero point right now. Okay. Oh, wow. Goodness, check this out. Okay. So before, that was my zero point. So check this out. So before, that was my zero point right there. Now I'm moved down to. I'm just going to go slowly. Right there. So I'm tripping at a uh, six, okay? Six right now. Before, I was at uh, eight, eight and a half. Now I'm at six. Goodness. So that's my tripping point. So, uh, man, that is a huge jump. That's big. Okay, uh, makes sense, okay, because, uh, H uh, that's more flat anyway. I'm just gonna go down right there. Yep, tripping right there, just below. So six is my more like five, like 5.9. Yeah, so 5.9 is my tripping point. Yep, so 5.9 is my, the point that triggers. Before, I'm at like eight. Okay. So I need some, uh, hold on, I need some kind of marker, okay. I'm just gonna remember for now. But yeah, I need something to, uh, I think I'm gonna give you a spare stickies uh, stickers or something like that so by the way if you are just joining us uh, welcome to live streaming yeah i mean again i mean that's i mean that's that's quite a bit that's big jump we got the again more like 8.426 that's huge yeah anyway so i'm gonna remember that position there okay so so this is a brand new <coughs> man you know what let's uh let's season some grinder okay so now i have to season it i'm not gonna do crazy right now i'm just gonna go through some coffee beans here a little bit not too much Okay, hold on a second here. Right now I'm at six. Yeah, I'm, let's set at ten. I'm gonna go some coffee beans. Okay, I'm, all right. I'm just gonna go one more. Okay, I'm, I'm just gonna go one more. By the way, I already 
grind some coffee earlier uh, about what 30 minutes ago so this is the uh, coffee grind from MP I'm sorry the HU so we are going to do some comparison right away okay let's go through the uh. Very curious myself as well. Okay, I'm very curious. You know what? I think you know. Let's go. We could, let, let's do it right now. I'm very curious about. Yes, it's not properly seasoned. People are watching. I know. Okay, but yeah, let's do it anyway. Let's do it anyway. I'm just gonna. Okay. Okay, if you are just joining us, uh, we are we are going to compare HU versus MP. Hold on, I, I, I want to see some grind. So this is a, a HU earlier. Okay. I'm using the coffee from Flower Child, very light roast. Cannot wait to. Compare this. Should be a lot of fun here, folks. I'm going to clean up a little bit before doing some comparison. Okay, here we go. Uh, we're gonna. Uh, I, I'm gonna. Okay. So for the consistent base, uh, I'm gonna be using third wave water for this test. Before I'm, we're gonna do that, I'm gonna put some little bit of coffee grinds in it. Flush out some old coffee there. Okay. I'm gonna flush out some more coffee. Again, uh, RDT is recommended. Definitely, I highly recommend the RDT. All right, let's do a 13 gram dose. This is a copy from Flower Child. We're going to do 13 gram pour over. 13.2. Well, let's check the, I'm going to do RDT this time. A little bit of RDT. Man, what a difference, guys. Okay, you see the difference? A little bit of uh, water droplet makes big difference. Okay. Okay. Let's start with the HU. Let's start with the HU birds.
So now we are brewing coffee with the HG birds here. Okay. I'm using the April dripper for the. I like using April as my kind of like test the brew quality, bird size. I got 12.7. Oh, that's fine. We're gonna do 200 gram. Pull. Here we go. I'm going to be doing a 30 gram circle, 70 gram center. So up to 100. I'm going to wait about 35 seconds. And then we're gonna do the, yeah, we're going to repeat the process about, again, 30 gram. There we go. I did 12.7 gram there. Okay, if you're just joining us, uh, welcome to live streaming. Uh, let's see here. Uh, so Paul, I have decided between HU, MP, or Omni, that's a Mizen, in the next two days, secure my P64. Uh, let's see here, reservation there. <clears throat> and then Paul also have a, ooh, would this be an upgrade for my DF83? Ooh. Paul, I don't know about 83, but 83 is, I'm liking it a lot, Paul. Okay, we are talking about 20 millimeter size difference. Okay. The size does matter for sure. Okay, right now I'm at 145 at the moment. Hold on. So this is a very light roast. So I'm very curious about what it tastes like on HU. Again, with uh, Meisenberg, you saw we just go through about, I don't know, maybe 60 grams of coffee just now. I know some of you likes to do about five to 10 grams in this channel. So, you know what? I, we're gonna have some fun here. Okay, we're gonna have some fun. Okay, I think we are, uh, it's, it should be about three minute uh, brew time there. I can see about three minute brew time. Again, if you're just joining us for the first time, uh, welcome to live streaming. Make sure, guys, we've got 27 of you watching right now. Make sure thumbs up, okay? Come on. I want to see the thumbs up on my videos. So we are at 305, 306. So about three... Uh, yeah. yeah, about three minutes and 320. Shall we call it at 320 or 330? Okay, let's call it at 3.35, okay, let's call it. Yeah, I'm gonna call it. Okay, let's call it. So let's work on this. So this is the MP birds right here, okay? I'm sorry, that's the HU, all right? Let's work on the next one, next bro.
So this is Meizen, also known as the omnibus. We are using the exact same equipment, same brewing method. Only thing difference is the uh, only thing difference is the birds. Okay, here we go. Okay, here we go, guys. 30 gram circle. Seventy gram middle. So my our H E burst three minutes and thirty second shot there. So this one is the Omni burst, uh, Myzen Omni. Uh, we we just go through about 50, 60 grams of coffee. That's it. Okay. You're gonna do a 30 gram circle. Go up to 200. Done. We got Meizen versus HU. I don't know. What do you guys think? Love to hear your thoughts on it, folks. Love to hear your thoughts. <coughs> Let's see, uh, Bruce from Canada. Uh, meantime, I'm gonna try this coffee. Okay, so let's start with HU. Uh, comes the tasting though on this one. Let's see here. It does not say on tasting notes. Ethiopia, wash, uh, flour. Uh, last time I tried this, I really enjoyed it. So I don't remember the tasting notes, but here you go. Cheers. Man. Flour, sweet. Very balanced. Okay, hold on. Uh, let's see here. Uh, Meisenberg's, we are at 2 minutes and 30 seconds. Okay. I mean, I like fast brew, okay? So, I mean, I like to be in around like 2 minutes and 30 seconds. Man, so this is exactly at 2.30 right now. But you have to remember, this, this grinder has not been seasoned yet, okay? 2.43. 2.43, so this is a Meizen. You know, Jesse is uh, drinking the same coffee. Good. So this is the uh, HU versus the Meizen. Okay. Okay, here we go. Okay, uh, so so let's try one more time here. Okay, here we go. Just a track, a track of a tropical fruit, jasmine. Yeah, jasmine. Definitely, I can taste the definitely jasmine, tropical fruit. Excellent. And then uh, berry sweetness as well. Great. Okay, definitely berry, jasmine. Okay, so H3 birds has been seasoned for a long time. So that's, I know it's not a fair comparison, but I'm very excited too. So this is the Meizen, okay. I'm gonna wash my taste book. Okay, here we go. Hi, happy holiday, guys. Man. 
Okay, hold on. A lot sweeter is obviously, is a, we are talking about minute slower, okay, faster. So uh, let's do one more time okay, because I want to be, uh, because I want to extend to like a, th a three and a half minutes because I want to compare apple to apple here. So this one was about three minutes and 30 seconds, 230. So let's extend it. Okay, way to do that is uh, you have to go uh, grind size uh, finer. So right now I'm at just under 10. I'm just going to go 9. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm going to go around 9. Yeah, hopefully that 9 give me more longer contact time there. One notch. Because I want to extend about a minute or so. Okay. So let's do that one more time. I'm going to do, again, a 13 gram dose. Uh, Jesse say, uh, how many kilo? I mean, people likes to go like five, 10 pounds, but for my philosophy on that is it's going to be eventually get seasoned. Okay. It's going to be eventually get seasoned. So, I mean, if you want the best results right away, you know, do it, you know, do season it. But, you know, if you, you know, I mean, Again, you know, use your coffee, so, you know, do whatever you want. I think I hope you have enough water there. I'm going to do a quick WDT. Just, again, just one score, okay? Just go nice and easy. Huh? Don't go heavy underwater. Hexcom, what's good knockbox? Uh, I prefer my garbage can. Right, my garbage can works pretty good. Okay, so we have HU, got the Mizen. Hopefully we have the right grinder setting here. All right, here we go. We're gonna try one more time. Uh, comes to paper wise, I'm using the Kalita 185, uh, 185 paper. And Kalita 185. Okay, here we go. I'm just gonna get the water temperature up. Man, I can smell the, oh man, tropical fruit. Definitely jasmine. It smells really good with the mizen. HP, uh, HU. Okay. I, 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 I don't want to say too much right now because I don't want to say too much because I know a lot of you out there deciding uh, which birds to go. You know, I know some people out there which birds for, you know. Unfortunately, most of us, we don't have that luxury, okay? We don't have that luxury to get a multiple grinder with a multiple bird set up. Yeah, we don't have that luxury. All right. So let's uh, let's brew this again. Uh, exact same brewing method. Uh, Thirty gram circle. Thirty. Seventy gram middle. Just go hard. 
And I'm going to wait about 30 seconds. I'm going to repeat the process. Again, uh, I mean, so I mean, so this is a like best uh, personal best method to like compare, uh, you know, comparison because there's no whole lot of move, you know, whole lot of steps to brew your coffee. Two phase, that's it. Because the last time, <clears throat> say she was around again, uh, three minutes and 30 seconds. Maizen was two minutes and 30. So, because I want to compare closest as possible. Yes, uh, this grinder has not been seasoned properly. So, have some issues. I don't want to say issues, but I know you, you guys want to see the, the true comparison. But it's going to be close enough. Okay, it's going to be close enough. So, coffee's been cooling down here. A lot more sweeter. Even with the unseasoned Meisenberg, Meisenberg is sweeter than uh, HU so far. Okay, because obviously this is a, you might want to say somewhat under extracted. 2.30 is a good time for me. I mean, 2.30, I like that around 2.30. But each year was uh, 3 minutes and 30 seconds. So, I mean, I want to be close. Okay, I want to be close as possible. Let's see. There's about 40 people watching right now, guys. Make sure thumbs up, okay? I see only 18 people with thumbs up. Obviously, you guys like my video enough to show up here, so. I think that... Again, the Google, what Google does is uh, whoever have more likes, they recommend to other viewers. Okay, but the thing is, is my, is my video, is a share worthy? Uh, maybe not, okay. Yeah, it's, some, some, uh, some topics, you know, easy to share, let's put it that way. But yeah, it's not a, sh you know, some videos, yes, but most videos, I'm glad you guys are here though. I'm glad you guys are here to hanging out with us this morning, this afternoon right now. Okay, so this is, uh, this cup is about about three minute mark here, about three minutes. Okay, about three minutes and ten seconds. So that's uh, that's close. All right. Okay, I think this is pretty close to this one here. This is the uh, HU. I'm going to cut it at 320. Okay. Uh, if you guys are, if you are just joining us, HU versus the Meisenberg, okay? From, op I mean, uh, optional. Uh, so that's their own design. So I think they want to try to compete with Casper's, I think. Design. Very similar to cast, but okay. So let's try this coffee here. I think I'm gonna start with the uh, HU first. Here you go, cheers. Okay, jasmine is there, berry is there, but it's not as sweet. Okay, let's put it that way. Uh, let's. Uh, Compare to, so this is the Meisen. Can definitely smell the jasmine. Cheers. Yeah, sweeter, brighter. Yeah, it's pretty silky smooth, very smooth. Yeah. Okay. So, so let's summarize this. If you guys are looking for something uh, multi-purpose, okay. If you're gonna do, you know, good espresso and especially good filter coffee, 
I think you might want to kind of lean into like Myzen, okay? Myzen bird is more for your speed. And if you are looking for something really clear, clarity, and then especially espresso, you want to see the separation of your tasting notes, the, those flavors. Uh, MP, okay? MP you're going to like. And then you are into more traditional espresso, uh, you want to go to HU. I mean, all those three birds handle the, you know, filter coffee. That's not a problem. But if you are looking for something sweeter, I think I go with, so you, something sweeter, you want to go with uh, Meizen, okay? If you had the optional option, uh, optional bur options there. Uh, something clean. MP is way to go, okay? Something cleaner taste. The separation of flavor. If you know something like a robust, I think HU. I think that's kind of like what I'm getting at right now. Okay. So, so here's what we're going to do. Not today. Uh, I have a lot of old coffee beans here right now. <coughs> I have old coffee beans. I'm going to go through with my Meisenbergs. So I'm going to season it properly. Okay. I'm going to season it. You know, not all the way. I'm not going to go through the five pounds for sure. But I'm going to go through maybe a couple pounds of uh, coffee beans tomorrow morning. Maybe even later today. I don't know. Uh, let's see. Maybe even later today. Let's compare cast versus Meisen. Okay. Let's compare cast versus Meisen. Let's find out. Okay. Let's find out comes to 64 millimeter. I mean, that's two most popular birds out there. So I'm very excited. I'm very excited to try. Anyway, I hope you guys are having a wonderful morning. Man, we've been at it for 37 minutes already, guys. And then uh, I'm gonna put the post uh, video this, uh, I just made a video on how to install the H, uh, you know, installation on uh, P64. They got some videos on YouTube, but it's, it's not give us a clear how to remove the bottom birds. So I made a video about that. So if you guys, uh, I'm, I'm going to post it tonight. So you, you guys are going to check it out tomorrow. Anyway, I hope you guys are having a wonderful morning. And uh, uh, I'm going to be at the Discord right now. So if you guys want to ask me about the birds or stuff, uh, just uh, come to Discord. I know most of you, I mean, most of you are, are Discord member anyway. So just come hang out with us right after this. Okay, see you next time.